that then, the end of season review. Let's have a look, see what happens. See how we did. The new arrivals is next. Um, C plus there for Tyrese Paul Jones. A C minus for Mark Cooper. Um, a C for Aaron Tumwa. C minus C. 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 I see. <laughs> I see what they're doing here. C. Kit Gregory got a C. Unbelievable. Right. Um. Okay. Um. Right. There we go. Season to remember. Board expectation was top half, and we won it. Average home attendance was 27, 2% of the average home attendance. Obviously, Paul Jones was a top scorer with 20 goals in 20 out of 20 games. He only played 18 of them, though. A+. Plus. There's our results throughout the season. Just the three defeats and three draws. Look at that for a start, though. We won 7-2 to start the season. <coughs> Excuse me. Then we won 1-0 at home. Then we won 4-1 away. And I was like, hey, this will be alright. Then we drew with Pointham, 1-1. One, one. And then Bennett then came, came to our place and we lost. Then we had a bit of a wobble. And then drew 1-1 one, one with Ray away. But then we got back on track and beat Northgate 2-0 and Skegness Town Reserves 3-1. Then Wibberton, who were bottom at the time, beat us 2-0. Who then go on to beat us again later in the season. Then we beat Fullback 3-0, Swineshead 2-0. Old League 3 1. Then we beat Coningsby 1 0. Then we absolutely hammered Bennington for giving us our first defeat of the season by 5 goals to 1. We then beat Poynton, Railway, Northgate, and Skegness before losing to Wibberton again. And then the last game of the season was absolutely fantastic. Go back to the last video for Football Manager to see what it actually meant to me and Taylor. We were sat here watching it. We went, we went behind. We pulled it back, we went in front, and then won and ended up 13 points clear at the top of the league with a massive goal difference with just 20 games of 29. Saying something when, like, bottom of the league, and we beat them 7-2 in the first game, um, only ended up with minus 19. And the other team that got relegated, only a minus 3. There was only two of us actually in a plus goal difference, 3 uh, three of us, sorry. We had 29 point and seven. Skegen average reserves with plus three. Three teams scored as many goals as they conceded. And one, two, three, four, five, six teams. Five teams, sorry. Ended up with minus goal difference. Um, two were minus four. Swines are minus three. Um, and we, we, con them three goals that we scored against them were the difference, which is a bit strange. Um, but yeah, what a season it was. It was fantastic. Let's have a look at the moments to remember then. Uh, our biggest win obviously was the first game of the season, 7-2. David McDermott with two. Tyrese Paul Jones got four of them. Uh, and Reese Powell got one. And we did go behind in the game as well, uh, after just two minutes. Our match to remember was a 5-1 win over Bennington. Menga, Paul Jones with a hat-trick. And uh, Kit Gregory, who also picked up goal of the season um, for that. So that's all good to see. Um, uh, I don't know what this is, but um, yeah, how are we lined up? Let's have a look at this. So that was our best 11.
um, Nicky Ayer, Nathan Ireland, who's not with us anymore, Yudo Kachima, Sadiku, who's not with us anymore, Koncheski, uh, David McDermott, Barry Kogan, Kit Gregory, Reese Powell, Hannah McKendy, and Tyrese Paul Jones. This is the bigger note. This is the accolades. And let's see what happened. So, manager awards. Um, yeah. Fans play of the season, Tyrese Paul Jones. Young play of the season, Tyrese Paul Jones. Sign another season, Tyrese Paul Jones. Goal of the season, Kit Gregory. And Tyrese Paul Jones got all of them. Um. Tyrese Paul Jones got most overall goals player in the season, most league goals by a player, most goals by a player in a match, most goals by a player in a league match, most assists by a player in the season. Actually goes to Barry Cogan with four, uh, Nicky here with the most clean sheets, he got two. Tyrese Paul Jones got six. Worst discipline was Reese Powell um, with five yellows and a red. We then had Tyrese Paul Jones with 18 appearances, most league outs by a player, most league goals by a player, Tyrese Paul Jones. Dennis Paker, the UC who we signed from the candidates, was the youngest player at 15 years, 356 days. Adriano Basso, who's not there anymore, 45 years, 224 days. Reese Powell got the fastest goal after 2 minutes 45. Benjamin Flowerdew was the youngest goal scorer at 20 years and 115 days. Elliot Godfrey, oldest goal scorer, just over 38 years old. History in the making. So there's a table. We won it. It was a superb season for the Magpies who exceeded expectations rather complain and claimed a deserved title. Well, thank you very much. We'll see you next time for our new season in a new league. And we'll take it from there. See you all soon, guys. Take Oh, what's all these? I, I, actually, hang on. 40 is a new team low. It's a new team low. It's a new team low. It's a new team low, apparently. Everything's just low. Not sure what has happened with that. But um, let's just go through these. Um, club vision and expectations meeting. Yeah, yeah. Finishing the top two places next. Oh. Right, okay. So we'll negotiate that. Finishing the top two places by the end of next season. That's going to be tough. We need to negotiate that just so we... Um... There we go. Of course we can. What about here then? Right, whatever. That didn't work, did it? Right, let's go for it. The team's on holiday. Oh, there we go. What's up with him? Don't know. There we go. Right, guys, that is it for us today. These are all on holiday. So we'll see you next time for more Spilsby Town action. We'll see you in the Lincolnshire League. Stay safe, take care. Goodbye.